Hi there, this is Pablo. I'm a business engineering architect at Salto and in today's video we're going to talk about how to set up your free account with Salto. With Salto's free account, you can perform a few valuable operations across your business applications such as Salesforce, Zendesk, NetSuite and many more. Let's go through them. The first one is you can search the metadata and configuration elements of your business application. This includes anything from hard-coded values such as user IDs, profile IDs, email addresses, and even the content within scripts and code. Another use case is you can see where metadata elements are used and understand their dependencies. This also lets you understand the impact of making a change to any configuration element. And finally, you can also configure Slack and email alerts so that you're notified when changes are made to your critical configuration elements. So with that said, let's go ahead and get started. The first step is to go to app.salto.io, enter your work email and your other details, and then just click sign up for free. Once you verify your email, it will ask you which business application you want to connect Salto with. So we support multiple business applications such as Salesforce, NetSuite, Sandesk, and many others. But in this case, let's just go with Salesforce. So I'm going to click Salesforce and then just click on next. And then I'm asked how I want to log into my business application. I can use OAuth or username and password. In this case, I'm going to go with OAuth. I'm going to allow access to Salto. And that's it. Now Salto has started a fetch. So a fetch is the way we retrieve and download all the metadata and configuration of your business application. We put this metadata and configuration in your environment, and this is what allows you to search your metadata, understand dependencies, and create monitoring alerts. The fetch process can take anywhere between five to 20 minutes, depending on the size of your business application. So let's just wait a few minutes. So the fetch has completed and now we can see all the configuration and metadata of my business application is available here in the element tree. So I can browse for instances and types as well. In a future video, I will explain how this works and how to search for elements in your configuration. Thanks for watching.